Hey everyone, today we're going to show you how to find a circular reference in an Excel spreadsheet. These can be very annoying and problematic. You might see this message uh, every time you open a certain Excel spreadsheet and it can be very, very annoying. So what you can do is just go ahead, easily find those and fix them so you are able to eliminate any of those, those errors and you can kind of get on with your life. And we're going to do okay here. It's something that's very simple. So we have a, you know, some sample data here it's showing our total sales. It should be showing something here. Something's going on. We know that for sure. So we're going to do formulas. Click on formulas. We'll go to error checking to the drop down menu there and then go to circular references. Once we click on that, it's going to show us exactly where that error references is. So then if we go over, click on it. It's going to take us exactly to E23, which is where our formula is. And then it's going to show us that that's where the error is. And if we want to trace our precedence, we can see that what this formula is doing is it's pulling itself in, which it shouldn't do because it's unable to calculate that. So very, very easy fix there. We can just go ahead and hit E22. And then that's going to eliminate that circular reference. So again, very simple to do, very simple to find. All you've got to do is go to uh, error checking, circular reference. And as you can see, now that it's grayed out, we know that we've eliminated all of the circular references from our worksheets. So we should be good to go here. And so again, very easy to do. Let me know if you have any additional questions here or, or you'd like to see any additional content on this. We'd be happy to support. And remember to like and subscribe to the Excel guy. Thanks and have a great day.